In 1984, Taco Bell unveiled the taco salad we've come to associate with the brand, and just two years later, in 1986, with a spark of innovation, they attempted to serve something nobody would see coming. It was a taco salad topped with shrimp, crab, and whitefish in a fried tortilla shell. The seafood salad was thought to be an appropriate rival to McDonald's filet of fish and Taco Bell was very proud of its newest creation, even taunting the unnaturally square fish patty of its competition in their commercials. Excuse me, I ordered fish. That is fish. I think. Why order fish when it ends up looking like a burger? Hey, Fred? Yeah. Is this fish? Introducing new seafood salad from Taco Bell. Fresh vegetables, tender bay shrimp, and a delicious blend of whitefish and snow crab. A refreshing change from anything on a bun. If it's square, it's fish. If it's round, it's a burger. New seafood salad from Taco Bell. The cure for the common meal. With the food industry rumor mill accusing Taco Bell of using great D meat, the addition of seafood is a bit worrying, but this menu item was sent to walk the plank after several reported cases of food poisoning. Taco Bell has never been shy about mixing up their menu and tried once again to dive into the deep in 2010 when it unveiled the Baja Shrimp Taco and Pacific Shrimp Burrito at select locations. Each came with six shrimp marinated in spices, pico de gallo, and avocado ranch sauce. This time, they plan to have the seafood options on the menu for a limited time only. Fast food seafood is risky business and yet many fast food places still want to offer an option to people who participate in Lent. Do you think Taco Bell will ever cast its net into the sea again? If you enjoyed the video please like and subscribe and thank you for watching. I'll see you next time.